Hey, what's up guys? David here, your Android junkie, your Android Spin.com, bringing you App of the Week, and we're going to be looking at a notification widget. I've actually showed you one before that was called Notification Browser, and that one was pretty cool, but this one's actually, uh, specifically, it was set to be um, for your lock screen, you know, for lock screen widgets on Android 4.2 and above. So, let's open it up, and as you can see, you can see my notifications right here. I just sent a tweet. Um, saying bye bye to chat heads, which yeah, I was just having problems with, and I got a text from my friend Vanessa, and um, yeah, it's a pretty cool little nifty little thing here. Like if I hit that, it just opens it right up, which is cool. You gotta love that. Um, let's go ahead and jump right into the actual app here. There's still a lot that needs to be done with this, like more customization, I think. But let's go look at general settings. You can have auto screen on, so if you got um, if you get a text or a message or just any notification, your phone will just turn on. But sometimes people don't like that. But they also have this uh, proximity sensor where, basically, if it feels that your phone is in your pocket, it won't turn on. So then you won't accidentally unlock it or whatnot. You know all that fun stuff. But that, of course, will um, yeah, it will suck up some of your battery. So that's whatever. Um, clear when unlocked, so after you've unlocked your screen, all your uh, notifications will clear out, or if you want to keep them in there, you can. See, collect when unlocked, keep collecting notifications. Yeah, that just means when you're on your, you know, when you're on your device or whatever, you're in an app or something, it'll still collect in there, which you don't have to have. I don't know, even know why I have that uh, checked off, but I do. Anyways, disable click, which means, that means, you know, how I clicked and it just went right in there. That means if uh, you just disable that, so you don't have that function. But let's see, let's see. We got appearance clock style. I just have a regular uh, Android 4.2 clock. You have auto switch or a uh, compact, make it smaller, or you can have it hidden if you don't want one. Clock color. I just have it white right now. I didn't think about changing it to blue. Let's go ahead and change it to blue. Then we got notification style. Um, which is just either compact or large, and I just have it at normal. What was this up here that I missed? Show clear button, that just, you know, the normal clear button that you see in your uh, notification drawer, so you can clear up, clear all them out. And, of course, you can uh, mess with all these, too, and change the colors, which is kind of cool. You know, so, I mean, I, I, guess I, I guess there is a lot of customization, but I don't know. I think uh, the notification browser had a little bit more. And uh, even if you wanted it on your home screen, you could just put it on your home screen, too, if, if that pleases you. Uh, monitor clear all experimental. These are just experimental stuff. I don't even bother bother to mess with. And then of course I got these apps with specific settings, which I have no apps with specific settings. So, but yeah, that's pretty much it. It's just uh, I mean I know a lot of people love the love dash uh, dash clock and stuff, and it shows a lot of your stuff. But I just I actually more oh, that's cool. Hollow blue or hollow blue, whatever the heck you want to call it. Hollow, yeah, it's probably hollow. Anyways, yeah. So it's a pretty interesting little widget. Um, I like it because I could just, even when you're right here, you could just click and open and it'll just open up whatever notification. Of course, I'm not getting any notifications right now. I just, I hit up like two or three people. My phone usually blows up a lot. Even when I'm filming a video, my phone will just blow up. But for some reason right now, everybody just knows that I'm shooting a video that where I need a notification to pop in and nobody's doing it. You gotta love it. I do. But yeah, notification widget, um, it's free in the Play Store, so I would say I suggest giving it a try. See if you like it, see if you like it better than Dash Clock. I know Dash Clock shows like other stuff like events and count you know, calendar events, alarms and stuff. But it doesn't show and it does show some of your notifications, but you get your actual notifications with like the notification uh, icons, which I like, so that's pretty cool. Anyways, guys, hit that like thumbs up button if you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already. Well, I am David, your Android junkie at AndroidSpin.com, and this has been App of the Week Notification a Widget. Love me some widgets. Alright, guys, talk to you later.